Hi, it's Zeke with the Eastside Church of Christ in Baytown, Texas. Thanks for joining us for another episode of Looking Up. You know, as we look out around us, we see that we are in desperate need of some unifying leadership. And people have historically sought out leaders. We set up our role models in entertainers and sports figures, hoping that we can emulate their formula for success. And then when they fail us, we take it personally. We believe that they've failed us personally. In times of crisis, we rally behind people who we believe align with our views, whether they're politicians, rappers, or religious leaders, because we want someone to believe in. We want somebody who can unite us, who can fight for us, who can lead us to better things. I mean, how amazing would it be to have a politician who could eliminate hunger? How amazing would it be to have a leader who could take away suffering or injustice or inequality? See, we want a king, but the problem is we want a king in our own image. The problem with that is our image is flawed because it fails to take into account our own shortcomings, our own weaknesses, our own failings. What we need is a man, but someone who's more than a man. We need someone who's not prone to our all-too-human weaknesses. If only there was someone mighty enough, someone powerful enough, someone good enough to unite us all. Well, surprise, surprise, there is. And he didn't come to eradicate hunger, although he gives us what we need to feed us and sustain us. He didn't come to eradicate inequality, although in him the playing field is level and he's the only one in whom true unity is possible. He's Jesus, the Son of God, the Son of Man, the only one who knows our predilections, our prejudices, our powerlessness to help ourselves and offers the only real resources that we need to rise above. We can continue to throw ourselves behind those people who we believe champion our causes, and we can continue to be disappointed in those same people when they fail us. But what we need, what we really need, is someone behind whom we can unite. And we can unite under the only one who truly has our best interests, all of our best interests, at heart. The Bible says in Galatians chapter 3, You are all sons of God through faith in Christ Jesus. For all of you who have been baptized into Christ have clothed yourselves with Christ. There is neither Jew nor Greek. There is neither slave nor free man. There is neither male nor female. For you are all one in Christ Jesus. There's only one who can truly unite us. There's only one who can give us everything that we need to really be united under Him. There's only one who cared enough for us to give His best for us. He's Jesus. Thanks for being with us today on another episode of Looking Up. God bless you.